Today I'll show you the easiest free way to create an account page like this. But what's so great about this? The template looks basic, right? Yes, it does, but hear me out. Do you see this navigation buttons? If I want to move this to the left, I'll have to use drag and drop, fix their position and more. But with this plugin, I just have to go here and click this button and it will change its position in just a few seconds. This is a small part of it, but let's see what else this plugin can do. So go to the description, click this link and it will take you to this page. Don't worry, it's free. I'll click free purchase and add in my personal info here. I'll create an account with my email ID. Check the boxes here and hit free download. Now I'll click here to download the plugin. Now let's install it on our WordPress site. Go to dashboard, click on plugin, add new plugin and upload the plugin by clicking here. Let's install and activate it. Once done, go here, click this and it will take you to the general settings. As you can see, some common settings are enabled here. Now, I'll show you how your customers can use these features. The custom avatar allows your user to personalize their profile while all other purchase details like addresses, past orders and account details are added to the My Account page after the order transaction is processed. Anyways, let's go to the website's front end. I'll click on my default avatar here to go to the account page like this. As a user, I can choose to change the avatar. So I'll click here, choose my file from this and click upload. Now let's see how we can customize this account page. Before we move on, we need to make sure that our site is fast because adding customizations like these can slow down even a new website and drive away visitors. So I'll go to elif.net, sign up from here, enter my website URL and click continue. Elif will now optimize your site and it does everything that your site needs for a 90 plus score like caching, image optimization, lazy loading and everything else. That's why you don't need to use multiple plugins for performance anymore. Just a lift is enough. The visual regression will also help you detect if any changes happened on your site. And in the rare occurrence, if you don't get a 90 plus speed score, you can just ping the free support here and they'll take care of it. Now let's move on to the next step. Here the users can get this dashboard view by default. Besides this, they can view their order history, its status and further details when they click on view. Here you have the saved billing and shipping addresses which the user can edit at the account details option. The user can easily change their password and email ID. Now let's customize some backend settings from the dashboard. For this, let's go back to the plugin interface and move on to the style options. Here, I can change the colors to give it a nice and refreshing look. I'll change the menu item color to this and the hover color to this. For the logout button, I'll keep the default colors as they look good to me. I'll now come to endpoints. Here, you can choose which essential details your customers would like to see when they click on a respective button. For example, if they click on orders, it should open up the customer's order history page and not the shop page. So, be mindful and choose the accurate endpoints by clicking on these dropdowns. By default, it selects the correct endpoints, but if you want to redirect users to a different page, just go here and add your link. Next, if you want to change the layout of this account page, just go to general settings here, select the sidebar and select right from the sidebar position. I'll go back to my account page, hit refresh and it's done. This looks even better. Comment below if you have any questions and I'll help you out. In this three minute video, I'll show you a free plugin to triple your site speed. You're really gonna thank me for this. So click here and I'll see you there.